Hello, dear students. In the last lecture, we have discussed about Scalar Triple Project. The link of that lecture is given in the description below. In this lecture, we want to discuss about Vector Triple Project. For a given set of three vectors, A, B, and C, the cross product of one of the vectors with the cross product of the other two vectors is called Vector Triple Project. As the name of Vector Triple Project suggests that the result of A cross into B cross C gives a vector quantity. Here the parentheses are very important because if you keep the parentheses at x cross x and then after that you take a cross with y, then you will get zero because there is angle of zero degree between x cross x. So x cross x will give you zero, so zero cross y is equal to zero. But if you put the parentheses on x cross y, then uh, as a result you will get x cross y is equal to z. And uh, then if after that, when you take x cross z, then you will get minus y. Let's have a look at this figure, where you can see that uh, b and c are in x, y plane. When you take a b cross c, then you will get a new vector in the direction of z, and that is b cross c. After that, if you take a cross b cross c, then you will get a, a new vector that is a cross into B cross C in XY plane. Hence, A cross B cross C is the vector in the plane of XY and uh, can be written as some combination of uh, B and C and that is AB plus BC. Where AB are the scalars which we want to find. One way to find uh, A and B is to write the vectors in component form relative to the axes, for example. B, which is along the x axis, we can write B is equal to Bxi, and C is in xy plane, so we can write both components of C. And first one is Cxi, which is along x axis, and Cyj, which is along y, uh, which is uh, along y axis. And A has all of the three components. Now, by taking B cross C, we get a new expression, and uh, where you can see we have I cross J. Uh, which is equal to k. So at the end you get b cross c is equal to b x c y k. Now when you take cross of b cross c with a, I mean I, a cross into b cross c, then you will get this expression. Where you have i cross k which is equal minus j and j cross k which is equal i. So you replace i cr cross k by minus j and j cross k by i. Because we are uh, interested to find the combination of A cross into B cross C in the form of uh, B plus C. So let's add and subtract this expression from this expression. So by adding and subtracting this expression into this, we get A cross into B cross C is equal to this. Now, if you look at this expression, this term AX, BX is nothing but a dot product of A and B vectors. And this whole expression is nothing but a C vector. And this whole expression is uh, nothing but a dot product between A dot C. And uh, Bxi is a component of B vector. So now replacing by these new expressions, we get A cross into B cross C is equal A dot C into B minus A dot B into C, where you have a dot C is nothing but a small A and a minus A dot B is nothing but a small B. So hence the value of a triple vector product is a linear combination of the two vectors. 